design and technology um, uh, are, have you, um, I mean, this is really wonderful stuff, but you know, one of the one of the questions that your administrator and school board might be asking, uh, have you linked all of this to the learning results? Have you uh, taken the design uh, and technology uh, uh, aspects of the learning results and really yes. zeroed into this? The way that the, the semester has been laid out so far is they'll do a project for about a month, and then we do a little core. So, for example, these students were learning statics. Uh, so, you know, straight out of my engineering textbook, you know, uh, moments, um, uh, forces, balancing equations, things along those lines. At the middle school level, straight from my you know, freshman year statics class, uh, then they learned about forces of materials, uh, material failures, and then applied that to a bridge design that they're doing. So we do that for a little unit, then we do another project, then we do another little unit on some other kind of engineering thing, and then they do their group project at the end. So, um, you know, these are the projects, but they're kind of a result of learning the little bits and pieces of culminating culminating events in which they demonstrate various aspects of the mini units you've done exactly. along the way. Yeah. So, yeah. Cool. It's wonderful stuff. Can I send uh, send some folks over for a visit sometime? Absolutely. Okay. You're at the Freeport Middle School? Freeport Middle School, yes. Right, right along the highway.